Hi, this is Mike Torres with WealthSecrets.com here to give you a uh, an update on my um, live results and settings using Zulu Trade. Today is Friday, September eighteenth, two thousand nine. Um, Zulu Trade. Uh, if you haven't opened an account yet, uh, you can go to WealthSecrets.com and click on Zulu Trade. And Zulu Trade is a company that has various system providers um, that place trades into your broker account. Um, so what you can do is um, I suggest opening a demo account first. You click on open account. You have two choices, a live account and free demo account. You can click uh, here free demo account, uh, fill out all the information there and they'll send you the logon uh, details and uh, you'll have a demo account with fifty thousand uh, dollars of virtual funds where you can try out different systems. When you're ready to open a live account you can click on new live account here and there are several brokers that you can choose from and uh, basically I use FXCM UK and uh, f to allow hedging so that way if I have various systems that are placing trades in opposite directions with the same pair then I'll be able to achieve that and basically after you uh, fill out this information here and you choose your broker you will you will be linking your account your broker account with Zulu Trade, so that way when the systems place the trades, they can um, send signals to your broker to go ahead and uh, open the positions. Okay, so let's go ahead and log in, and I'll show you my live account. And um, basically, I started in July 1st of 2009 with five thousand dollars, and. Um, yeah, I have some open positions right now. I'm negative two dollars. I trade one mini lot per position. Uh, my balance was much higher than this, and I'll go ahead and give you what it was from July 1st to now, September 18th, and um, I was up to I had uh, sixteen hundred dollars. Well, here, let's just go back to August, the end of August, so you can see where my highest balance was with $1,600, you can see here. And uh, I had a big drop, uh, basically because I added um, some systems and added some positions. And I'll go ahead and share with you my experience, so then I can go ahead and save you time, money, and energy, and, and uh, some grief. Uh, basically... What you want to do is go into settings and you're going to want to really know how to use this part of Zulu Trade because here's where you can limit your risk uh, in, the, in, the, in the following ways. On the following systems that I have, it's Surfing, Lowest Drawdown, Hidalgo FX Capital, and Creative Trading. I have one mini lot per position on Hidalgo on the Euro USD. I changed it to two mini lots. And also on the Aussie dollar because they have been uh, pretty consistent. But on the pound dollar, well, I'll go ahead and show you here. Configure currencies. See, I was able to increase on a particular pair too many lots for the euro dollar, zero lots for pound dollar. I don't want to trade the pound dollar. They they haven't been too consistent with that with that pair. And then the Aussie dollar, I put too many lots and then left the maximum trades per currency. I didn't want to increase my exposure that way. So we exit out of there and basically uh, a little bit more explanation on this is that with the maximum open trades per currency you can limit limit your exposure and limit the amount of trades that are opening. And I'll tell you what happened in the end of August I wanted to increase one of the positions an extra position for lowest drawdown and I had incurred I'll go straight to that system there lowest drawdown and what happens if you have that set to two maximum trades open per currency you can have a if they open them back to back within five minutes of each other you'll have this and then I had two losses they open it up within this was within an hour of each other and I experienced two losses back to back. And so this is something that it's going to be based on your uh, risk appetite. If, if you have 
a small balance I don't recommend it and even here I'm probably overextending myself with two positions if they go they both go bad that's close to what five to six hundred dollars that's ten percent of my account from a five to six thousand uh, dollar balance uh, let's go back to all signal providers so I can show you something here I had tried various systems uh, the big win which I no longer trade I'll go ahead and, and uh, tell you which ones I don't trade anymore and that's big win the beyond parity uh, the pips vitamin only sunny days and, and this is a manual trade that I place I've experienced too many losses with this system pips vitamin I'll go ahead and show you that and I have since removed that system you can see it doesn't look too pretty that equity curve and uh, I'll show you the losses here that I've experienced just a lot of red so I definitely had to get rid of that system there. I'll go one by one, starting with uh, creative trading, which they uh, I'll go back as far as July 1st when I open the account to see how, how they've been doing. And you can see that I'm negative $880. So I'm going to have to go ahead and remove that system. It's just too many, too many losses for the amount of pips that they're gaining. And... Um, I'll go to Hidalgo FX, which is one of my favorite systems. It's probably the number one system. And it will show me here how many pips and how many profits I've gained. It's $897 and 903 pips. They've had a couple losses, but they were able to get out of them. And the next favorite system is lowest drawdown. And we'll get those results I'm up seven hundred sixty dollars since July 1st I've experienced a lot more uh, losses but at least I'm still up I'm up seven hundred sixty dollars and then all so uh, only sunny days I removed they just weren't um, producing they weren't they didn't have any trades I'll go ahead and show you so you can see maybe two trades since in July July 16th and July 31 so I went ahead and removed that then I added a new system that I've been demo testing for a while. It's surfing. They haven't opened too many positions, but it's only been two days. So, uh, but I have restricted them to one currency, um, one transaction open at a time, and also one max currency, uh, one max trade per currency to limit my risk. So, I've decided to stick with. Hidalgo FX and lowest drawdown and I'm going to go ahead and remove creative trading. The way you do that is you go to settings and you click next to the signal provider there and you go ahead and remove signal provider. Okay, so I'm just trading with these three systems, surfing, lowest drawdown, Hidalgo FX capital and I think that I'm just going to stick with this for a while. I think sometimes less is more. Uh, the moment you start adding systems, they um, start kind of reacting each other and, and then I start incurring losses so I'm just gonna stick with that for a while I think that's it for now uh, if you have any questions um, you can go ahead and email me Mike at wealthsecrets.com I hope you found this video uh, to be a benefit to you if so you can go ahead and rate my video by clicking over here on the stars obviously I can't rate my own I'm, I'm logged into my channel I have a channel at YouTube, so you can also subscribe uh, to my videos. So as soon as I create them and up update my uh, new my settings and live results, you'll go ahead and be you you will be informed of those as well. And I also, if you'd like, if you don't want to see a video, you can go to my blog at ZuluTradeResults.com, and here I'll go ahead and keep uh, a static copy of my results and keep you updated with some different settings and new systems and you can go ahead and upload or you can go ahead and if you want to go ahead and open a um, an account go ahead and click Zulu trade link there and then you can go ahead and click on uh, open an account and like I said I highly suggest opening a free demo account and really get to know the system I like uh, trading with Zulu Trade. I've been trading with them, like I said, since uh, before July, obviously three months in demo. I trade robots as well. 
but I really like Zulu Trade because this is something that I can do in addition to the robots. I don't have to mess around with updating the robots and um, you know have a have a Forex VPS, a hosting account, and that I don't have to even log in and check in there and, and resources. So I really like Zulu Trade, and um, I look forward to collaborating with you. If you have any questions, like I said, go ahead and send me an email and um, we'll talk later. Take care. Till next time. Happy trading. Bye-bye.